Hello, people. Today I'm doing an airsoft video. And in this airsoft video, I'm doing something stupid. So I'm making a uh, shield out of the whatever trash I could find around here. And then I'll put it all together and see if it could survive all of my airsoft guns. So I'm gonna have my brother shoot at me while I'm gonna hide behind the shield and see if it works. As you see, this shield looks like trash, because you are right, it is trash. So I have a little trash um, bin lid as the main frame. And I managed to find some duct tape to tie everything together. And be back here, I have quite a bit of junk. I have a couple of cardboard boxes stacked on top of each other. Then I put some um, little uh, string on it, a bunch of string on it because from the hay. And then I have a little uh, bottom of a uh, broken baby car seat. So I'm going to see if this could manage to survive all the um, airsoft pellets. So let's see how it works. First we're going to start with the weakest gun. This is an electric uh, double eagle uh, G36 model and it's only around 200 FPS and so it's not very powerful. Well here goes nothing. Let's roll. I see absolutely nothing happened. 200 FPS didn't do anything to my magnificent shield. Next up will be the UK Arms, well, Beretta model. Not sure about its complicated, just a bunch of number and alphabet name. But this is uh, a little bit more FPS, it's 250. Nothing happened. We're going to jump up a little bit again with the popular Crossman Steiner P311. Uh, 320 feet per second. Get 320 FPS, let's go. At least it dented the duct tape, but that's it. Then we got this Double Eagle Shotgun, 330 FPS, which, um, I don't know if it's only 330, I think it's like 350 and 60 because it's pretty powerful. 350 FPS, let's go. Okay. It cracked over here, but that's it. Then we're going to do a massive jump in FPS with this Lancer Tactical MMC. This is 420 FPS. And I'm pretty sure this will do a lot of damage. Now we jumped quite a bit, 420 FPS, and I'm kind of scared. So, don't miss. Wow, um, not even that past it, just a bunch of big cracks. This is a UTC Tactical uh, Gen 5. And it's 470 to 80 FPS, so it's a little jump from the Lancer Tactical. And this is the final gun. Looks like, um... I even the staper did it, so they even passed the cardboard. Rampage phone full automatic. Oh, well, it penetrated almost all the cardboard. I only had one more layer to go. And yeah, but it didn't pass the uh, little string and definitely didn't pass this. So I'm pretty good. Okay, so as you see, Rampage mode of one of my second most powerful electric weapon uh, didn't even penetrate all the cardboard. So I'm taking bigger measures. I'm gonna use this buck knife, I'm gonna stab it. Ah. Ok, 
Okay. As you see, it uh, didn't get through all the layers of the cardboard, almost all, just like the airsoft gun. <clears throat> well, the shield wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be, so let's take even bigger measures. Okay, this is the last thing we're doing. The 50 pound crossbow, and we're going to see. I doubt that's going to make it, so let's try it out. I'm not going to pull it all the way because I don't want to go in too far off because it's probably going to go right through, so here goes nothing. Holy guacamole! It uh, went through everything except for that little, uh, that little kid seat. As you see, it's like poking out. Do the second attempt. Uh, we're gonna add some more power. Heal it. Territory. The stupid bow. I mean, not stupid. Shh. Now look at that. It did manage to go through, but it didn't like go right through because of the little strings. That's crazy. I didn't know a 50 pound, uh, well, I should say 40 pound compound bow would uh, not go through this. That's crazy. I didn't know this piece of garbage could do that. Well, there we have it. The shield did it. And I'm going to go out to war with this. So, see you guys. Thank you so much for 45 subscribers. It means a lot to me. And I'm going to be looking by. I'm going to war, really. I am. Because, I mean, survived an arrow. I mean, might survive a, an AK caliber, right? <laughs> well, see ya.